Hello, this is David Schwab, and I recently had the great experience of interviewing Dr. Andrew Alpert. Dr. Alpert is a periodontist in Aventura, Florida. We conducted the interview via Skype. Dr. Alpert provided just great answers to frequently asked questions. Here's a portion of that interview. Can dental implants be used to replace just one tooth, or is the procedure used only to replace all the teeth? No, dental implants can be placed for one tooth, or they can be placed used for people who need an entire set of teeth. So first, let's talk about the individual implant. A patient has had trauma to an upper front tooth. They lost a tooth. They don't want to have what's called a bridge. So a dental implant is the ideal situation. And what do we do? We typically build up the bone. We have to build up the gum tissue. And then we place an implant. That is, our office places the implant. That's the replacement for the root. And then the dentist places the cap on top of the implant. Now we'll take the other extreme. They have no teeth in their mouth at all. So we can put in some implants on the lower, for instance, four implants to support a lower removable denture. We could put in six implants to support teeth that are connected to the implants directly that are not removed. We can put in perhaps eight or 10 implants and give the patient a full set of new teeth through caps throughout the full lower. And the same principle basically applies to the upper. So we deal from one implant to many, many implants. I want to thank Dr. Alpert for joining us today and sharing his expertise. Dr. Alpert is accepting new patients, and he may be contacted through his website, alpertdentalimplants.com. This is David Schwab. Thanks for watching.